huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Well, DC, this is a true mixed martial artist of the highest order. You've watched the film. Hard for me to see much in terms of glaring weaknesses, and he believes he can react to anything that is thrown his way inside that eye. It's unbelievable, because whenever you're trying to prepare for someone, you look for weaknesses. But when you watch this guy, you, nothing jumps off the page. When you think I have to go wrestle him, you realize very quickly that not only can he defend takedowns, he can also go and secure it with sure. himself. He's that new breed of fighter that has been doing every discipline from the very start of his career. You know you're looking at a guy that will contend for a championship. And if our fighter meeting on Thursday is any indication, confidence, not an issue for this young man coming in here tonight. Well, we probably trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts more than we should, but this fighter certainly fits the bill. Oh, 110%. He can do everything inside the octagon. Where he is most comfortable is inside of that eight-sided structure right. where most men are terrified of being. But for this gentleman, he only wants to be there. When you try to wrestle him, he's able to defend takedown. If you dare stand and strike with him, he can knock you out. He's got all the tools necessary to become a UFC champion. His first martial art, mixed martial arts, <laughs> and that's not always the case. I feel like both of these guys are the top of the food chain. They're the best of the best that we can put inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded. They have every skill, and that is going to be on display tonight in this team matchup. Well, he's got the reach advantage. He might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that chip. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the count. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, nice connection there with the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Very good sign here early as he gets the takedown in round one. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch. In oh, it looks like he's transitioning to an armbar. You cannot stay in the guard of these great jiu-jitsu guys. Attack an armbar. All right, north-south position here. We'll see if the crowd can be mature about this, DC. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you got to be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes on your opponent. You can throw down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Nice punch there. Under three minutes remain in round one. Strike oh, lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Close guard. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Looking for a guillotine.
beautiful movement, hip work on the ground here, just outstanding with the transition. He is not staying in one place on the ground, and that's very important. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Big punch lands over the top. I was gonna follow this one. He blocks the punch. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Just unable to quite find that range. Pretty good right hand. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. The right hand just misses. And that strike blocked by Johnson. Right there, his opponent's wobble chair. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to wrestle. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. The Korean Superboy gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Lands the double jab. He's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Choi. Oh, and he lands another takedown here, just doing a nice job not telegraphing his shot. Clean entries. The Olympian's got to like what he sees. I mean, over and over, he gets to the legs before his opponent reacts. By beating him on the entry, now it's up to the opponent to keep up. But this guy's playing. Now he has a headlock trying to pin his opponent's back down flat onto the mat. Look for him to transition to an arm triangle to try to chase the finish. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. So the fighter was really caught in the submission there just as the horn sounded. Safe to say he was saved by the bell there. So back to the stools they go. 60 seconds to recover here. We're going to fight on, ladies and gentlemen. Another round coming up. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committed to it fully. He throws his jab. He may... Oh, and he gets the takedown there. Too easy, Chief. Too easy. He has impeccable timing on these takedown attempts. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. Right now, it looks like he may be trying to set up an arm triangle choke. He needs to secure the left arm, push it across, and secure it with his head. Watch triangle, watch triangle. Posturing up now, nicely done. Johnson's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. All right, good movement by him here on the ground. He really is a master of these transitions. He is a master of movement on the ground. You never know where he's gonna be. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, nice strike landed there by Johnson. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, and there's a takedown attempt. Not a great entry there. Not a great entry. He showed everything he was going to do. He didn't hide his takedown. You knew from the moment this fight started, he was going to go get a shot off. The opponent was ready, and he defended it perfectly. Just over three minutes to go. Right. And now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you, in the night, that one man is right on the spot. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Beautiful knee. 
trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, there it is again. He just continues to keep landing those takedowns, scoring a lot of points. His opponent has showed a pretty good getup, but not sprawling, not stopping. He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's going to try to move his left arm across to get pressure on the choke. All right, so he postures up and then he's out. Secure that head and arm and get the side control. Let's go. No hand pass. Down into his mouth. The Korean Superboy gets back up again. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. Got to slow down. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step. It's getting this to slow down and fight at your pace. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of Another big kick down. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's... He's going to start trying to move to a submission here. It looks like he's trying to attack the arm triangle. So there's the end of the round. A lot of high-level action. And if you like the takedown game, as my boy Daniel Cormier does, you enjoyed that round. It's like we're watching the NCAA wrestling tournament. It's takedown after takedown. He's fighting his fight. He's able to change levels, drive into his opponent, and secure takedown after takedown. You ready to fight? You ready? Third round underway. Punch lands. Now he gets back to range. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Johnson's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. All right, so maybe he goes for another takedown here, and it's the setups too, right? He's not blindly shooting from the outside. Maybe he'll get him down again. He's doing a fantastic job of setting up his takedown with his hands. He's forcing the hands up around to block his face, and then he's dropping his level, shooting his shots. Recovery, man, right back to his feet. Just misses there with the left. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight push. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many. What a wrestler. That was an amazing thing now. And there's the single leg. I love watching this guy move on the ground. Another nice transition there. Such a high-level grappler. You don't see that very often. 
Well, he's got his back now. Johnson gets back up again. Nice punch land. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He's done, he's done. Oh my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet.